Hey everybody, um, it's been a while since I posted an update, so I wanted to go ahead and do that. As you can see, I'm lying in a bed, hospital bed to be exact. Um, I just finished my first round of chemo. I'm still getting IV fluids, which will be for the next probably 16 hours or so. I'll be here till about noon tomorrow. Um, I'm feeling okay. Uh, a little tired, kind of hot. It's overheating me in here. But this is the first step in getting my life back on track. Um, the hospital is beautiful. My room is beautiful. Um, the nurses have been fantastic. Um, it's been a, a good experience overall. Um, it's taken two years to get here, but I am thinking it's going to be worth it. Um, after this, I will be discharged tomorrow around noon and go back to the hotel. I will be in Chicago through the 24th. Um, I will have to have shots to up my stem cell, um, production. And then on the 23rd, I'll get a catheter placed right here in my jugular. Um, that'll be the second time I had one of those. Don't mind me, I'm just checking my hair as I make this video. Um, so then once I get the catheter in my jugular, they will harvest my stem cells. And, um, and once I do that, I will get to go home. Um, I will be home probably the 24th through the 31st. And then mom and I will come back to Chicago on November 1st. Um, and then I will be admitted to the hospital on November 3rd. Um, once I'm admitted to the hospital, I will have four more rounds of chemo. So this beautiful new hair will be gone, even though it is super fun. And then after the four rounds of chemo, I will get my stem cells back on the fifth day. And at that point, it's kind of just a waiting game. I have to wait till my... Um, blood counts get to a level where it's safe for me to leave the hospital. Um, it's, a, it's a process for sure, but I want to keep you guys updated. I want to show you guys what's going on um, and let you follow me if you want. Um, you can follow the channel if you want to get you know, notifications when I put up a new video. I would love it if you followed me. Um, I had to come in on, early this time. We came in on Tuesday night um, because I had a chest x-ray last week and it came back and showed something a little weird in the chest x-ray so they wanted to check on that uh, the chest CT did came back and there wasn't anything alarming that my transplant had to be delayed or anything um, the doctor is worried I may just have some asthma so I'm going to meet with a pulmonologist while I'm here um, so we have been here since Tuesday, so Wednesday we did a lot of shopping because it was raining, and yesterday we went to the Brookfield Zoo, which is amazing. If you are ever in Chicago, I would highly recommend it. Um, and a lot of eating. We've been doing a lot of eating. I mean, really, if you know me, that's pretty typical. But I am doing okay. I'm alive over here. Uh, alive and as well as possible. I'm looking forward to getting out of here tomorrow. <laughs> Uh, but I hope everyone out there is doing well, um, and thank you for keeping up with my journey. I will talk to you all soon.